So this morning I went to Princess Auto for breakfast and because uh, they had free donuts and coffee and stuff and uh, while I was walking around over the intercom they said they had surplus mystery boxes and so I got two of them. And this is $15 and then on the floor there's a mystery box that is $5. It weighs 20 pounds. It weighs 8.3 pounds. All right, let's get into this. Oh, one more light, hold on. Plug that one in. There, we're all good now. All right. Uh, I don't like drinking warm beer. That one's heavy. You hear that? They probably just put gravel in it and they said they had a surplus. They just scraped, <laughs> they probably just scraped the parking lot. Okay, we'll sit down here, get this out of here. Here we go. All right. The level of excitement that I have opening this is pretty high. Should you guys look first? I think you probably should. Ready? Oh, it's loaded. Guys, it's loaded with stuff. <laughs> oh, man. Look at the stuff in there. So, a little story on how... Oh, my gosh. If any of my family is watching, all of my shopping is done in this one box. All right. Here we go. This is a good time. What are we saying? Here we go. Oh, there's, there's Dad. All right, so first thing out of the box, tough built, non-marring snap shells for knee pads that I don't own. Cool, cool, cool. All right, next thing up, we've got a pot ring. And this pot ring can, am I probably too far away, aren't I? Can you guys see this? It's okay, I guess. Sure, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Cat litter, probably. Um, this looks like it kind of hangs on a, on a, on a, a pot thing, or a, like a background thing, like a, like one of these, and hang on that, and then you put stuff in it. Neat. Guys, this is already worth five dollars. Closer. All right, Thomas says closer, so Thomas will get closer. Hold on, I'm coming. This is a little harder to do. It's a small room and the phone needs to be plugged in. Hold on, we'll make this happen. We'll make this happen because Thomas said closer. We'll make it closer. Is that better? Yeah, I think that's better. Maybe taller too. Maybe a little higher. There. I don't want you guys to see all that good stuff, though. I don't want you to see all that good stuff. I appreciate that, Thomas. Okay, I'm still plugged in. Good. Here we go. All right, I'm just going to stand up and show you a little closer. All right, here we go. Look at that. That looks like it's for a Samsung phone case. It's hard to see, though. It's very hard to see because, well, you can only see one side of it. Is it good? Good. Okay, here we go. What's up next? An axle mount. Yeah. Axle mount for a GoPro or something like that. I might use that. This is the package for... The phone case. Uh, neat. This is the perfect hole. It's uh, for drills. It does drilling or something. Oh, how, Stephen, here's the story about how I heard about this box. So this morning I was up early doing some Black Friday stuff for work. And 
after I got the work stuff done, I, uh, I checked my inbox and I saw that Princess Auto had free coffee and free donuts. I hadn't had breakfast yet. So I ended up going to Princess Auto for breakfast and uh, I had I had some coffee and I got some donuts and then from overhead this this heavenly voice said in the warehouse we still have some $15 and some $5 mystery surplus boxes and I said sure sign me up so I went back there and I grabbed a $15 and a, and a $5 um, a five dollar box and this is the five dollar box uh it weighed in at uh 8.3 pounds and the 15 dollar box weighs in at 20 pounds all right i did yeah three donuts as that's how many donuts you can have before they look at you with their eyes and they they tell you you've had enough i think if i had a fourth donut they there would have been some judging okay on with the box we've got the GE Ultra Pro speaker subwoofer wall plate yeah that's that would have been five dollars next up oh this is good we've got a buttstock cartridge holder uh, that's good stuff. This, that's going to be, that's good. What else do we have in here? There's still quite a few things in here. <laughs> Look at this beautiful thing. What do they call it? Here for the Tacoma is the shaggy black rear view mirror cover. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Bring what closer? Oh, you need bring them on camera. Oh, you maybe need to be closer. Let's bring it even closer. All right, I can't really get much closer than that. No, I can't. Why not? Let's go closer. Here, you probably even hear me better now too. Oh man, look at the wings. I need a haircut. Oh gosh. Okay, that better? That's better. Now I can just be like, all right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right. Interesting, interesting. We've got some Black Ops enemy uh, targets. They're, they're paper targets to go along with. Um, what did you miss? I'm not going to go through everything, but there's this, there's this set of snap-on um, hollow snap shell things for... Uh, knee pads that I don't have. Just as a thong. Wonderful. Okay, what else is in here? Ooh. Press on corner masking for painting. These are, these are nice. Yeah, this is the $5 box. Uh, that's what's going on now. Okay. There's only one thing left in the $5 box. We're already at the end of the $5 box. I don't want it to end yet. I'll have it. I'll have a sip of the imported Iron Brew. That's imported from Scotland. It's a secret recipe since 1901. I first had this on the, um, I don't remember if it was more post to post or something else. Mouse on a cat toy. I know what it is. Oh, there we go. Hmm. How many people do we have here? 20 people. That's great. Okay. Here. I, I don't have, it's not beer. It's just soda. I do have beer in the fridge. I went and got some, I blame it on Craig. And um, I, I got a lot actually. I got some local beers and some uh, Irish beers. And here it is. The last of the five dollar box. Here we go. It is the Bulldog Vault. It's easy guide ribbed top pad for quick entry. 
Let's take a look inside here, shall we? Why does it plug in? There's a plug in it. I might need the keys. Oh, that's why it's surplus. There's no key, is there? For anybody that's joining, I am opening up. There is no key. There is no key. There's no key. Unless it was in that thing that I just threw. There's, there's no key. There's no... All right, tune in next time when we open this up on a live stream with power tools. The, the, the key. Oh, I got the key. We can open it now. Best item in the $5 box? I'm going to have to say probably this Bulldog Vault. But those knee pads, uh, I don't know. And that phone case? I don't even... Like, it's missing the rest of the packaging. Uh, where is the phone case? It was down here somewhere. That's pretty... I'll use that. Like, I'll use that phone, that uh, GoPro mount. If it'll fit on my bike anyway. But this is pretty cool too, though the 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 shaggy uh, rear view mirror thing. That's that's pretty cool. Yeah. So if anybody that is joining us now, uh, I have just opened the first five dollar um, surplus box from uh, from Princess Auto. Um, you can buy them in store on Black Friday. It's five dollar. I bought a five dollar one, and I bought a. A $15. Oh, there's an alarm in it. It actually has an alarm. So, like, it's got, like, reset, and there's a cable on it, and it's got, like, a reset and a mute button and and a little flashing light. Like, what is this? Well, who needs this? I guess that's how it ends up in... If you need it, you let me know. All right. So that is it for the $5 box. What do you think? Was that worth $5? I do believe it was. Yeah, sure. Okay. What's next? Oh, everybody knows what's next. It's a $15 box. Oh, Kathy, pretty much all of my Christmas shopping was done in these two boxes. Here we go. Let me get this. Hear that? Any guesses? It's heavy. This is a heavy box. Uh, 20 pounds is what this box weighs. I'd have bought them all, really. If I could have carried them, but too many donuts. All right. Tune in tomorrow night. No, I'm not going to do that to you. Oh, what do we got? I don't want you guys to see it right away. See, this box is heavy and it's big. So when I when it's big and heavy, I, I think that there's just going to be one thing in it. All right, we've got... Here we go. I don't know what this is. It's... Uh, it's a camo shower curtain. Oh man. I think it's a camo shower curtain. It's got snaps on it. Maybe it's just a tarp. I don't know. What is this? Oh, it totally is a shower curtain. It totally is a beautiful, a beautiful shower curtain. It's gorgeous. Wouldn't you guys love this? How about that? Which one of my friends, which one of my family members wants that for Christmas? You let me know. I'll roll that up for you. And in case I don't... Oh, good question. You know what, Thomas? I don't even think... Can people see you in the shower? No. The answer is they can't even see the shower. Invisible. All right, $5 box. We've got, I don't think it's a blind. I think it's all, like it's it's huge. I think there's a drawstring on the bottom too. So, I don't know. I don't have enough room to, I don't, I'm gonna have to move it back for the camera back for two, like, there's a rope on it. There's like, what is that? Do? You know what it might be? It might be,
It might be like one of the like uh, tent pole tents. Do you know what I mean? You put the string down the middle of it and it's just a triangle. I, I don't know. Whatever it is, Amber's going to be angry when it's in the bathroom. For a little bit. I don't know what the snaps are for. The snaps all over it. Let's get to this rope thing. Oh, I know what it is, you guys. I know what it is. I know what it is. Bike cover could be. Could be. That <laughs> could be uh, for, for dragging your deer out. Oh, Kathy. You guys. Is this the head hole here? Oh, come on. I just remember that scene in Ace Ventura where he's coming out of the rhino's butt. That's what that felt like. <laughs> yeah, Craig, you get it. You get it. Man, this is... I think this might be better than a shower curtain. It could... I could still wear it in the shower. All right. All right, we're, we're keeping this on. That's what the snaps are for, is to make the arms. It's nice, eh? Can you can you guys still see me? <laughs> okay, okay. So, so here we go. So, somebody else in my Christmas list is gonna be really happy if they saw that, because now you get another one. So people on my list, I can make two people happy with the shaggy rear view mirror uh, thing. <laughs> Talking head video. You can't see me. What else is in here? Guys, I know if you thought I was going to wear out the first pair of knee, snap on knee guards, well, you're wrong. Now I've got another set and they go on to me things that I don't have. All right, what's next? Oh, oh, this is something we get to open again. Yep, where's my knife? All right, here we go, I'll find out what this is. Now we're into the true surplus stuff. Let's find out what this is. I don't, for anybody that's watching, we are opening box number two um, from Princess Otto's mystery surplus box, a Black Friday thing where I... Exhaust hanger? Do you think that's what it is? Yeah, could be. Could be. What else could it be? Oh, 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 towel, towel bar. Towel bar? Do you think it's a towel bar? Anybody think it's a towel bar? Bolt that up, put it like that, put your towel over it, your face cloth over it. Bets on towel bar. Kickstand, maybe, but there's nothing on the end of it. Muffler hanger. Could be a muffler hanger. You got a couple of muffler hangers. I think that goes, and it is sun visor for 1988 Lada. Could be that too. All right. What's up next in our $15 box? Oh my God, you guys, are you guys, are you guys? Look at this. 
We've got a pair. We have a pair. Oh, outfit your entire exhaust on your 1988 Lada with two. Hold on. Oh, they're strong. They're not going to go. This will still be around when your 1988 Lada is nothing but uh, a rust bucket. Or matching towel racks for your garage, right? Dual exhaust the taco. All right. What is up next in here? Anybody who is just joining us now, um, this is a Black Friday um, passenger mirror. For the, um, this is a Black Friday mystery surplus box that I picked up uh, at Princess Auto. It was $15. We've already opened the uh, $5. This is a $15. Carrying on. We have... You guys see that? A premium boat cover accessory. Trailering, trailering straps and toe down, tie downs. Look at that. Huh? Yeah. Boy. Gotta get me a boat. I'm kind of cheating by looking around in the box. Oh, here's another classic surplus white box. Huh? What's in it? I don't know. Let's have a look. Oh. Oh. Oh, look at that. That is going to be beautiful. Wow, look at that. That's really nice, isn't it? All right, you know what it is? It's, um, it's a 12 volt light. Uh, and I guess that unscrews there. Uh, uh, it comes off somehow, but it's like an RV light. So like, is it LED? I thought it had an amperage rating on it there somewhere. Manufactured in June 2011. There's a part number on it. Somebody want to Google it? Part number is 001-52. Manufactured. Oh, no. Distributed by Command Electronics. All right. Moving on. Next in our Princess Auto box of crap... Self-adhesive felt pads. Cool. Oh, if you're just joining, this is this is also from this box. I've got this beautiful poncho. It's hard to see. I understand if you're having trouble seeing it, and that I'm just a talking head. All right. Here we go. What else we have in here? We have a pontoon first aid bag right there halogen interior light look at that 12 volt how many watts 20 20 watts 12 volts headlight for 1988 ladder there you go all right oh guys this is still putting out oh my god I wish I had found these earlier. Huh? Huh? I think so. Why not? Yes. Yes. Okay. What else do we have in here? Oh. 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 Are you serious? It's a pair. It is a pair. We've got a second interior light huh 20 watts look at that another interior light beautiful we've got a pair 
I'm taking offers. You guys put the offers down in the comments. 15 bucks for the pair. Half? <laughs> it's hard to see now. Is this... Also doubles as a heater. It would, wouldn't it? Uh, it'd be... It would be really good for... Um, I don't even know what was in that. Oh, man. You guys, this is so awesome. Whoa! Look at this! Tire fill. CO2 cartridges for Schrader valves. So, oh, fits all Presta and Schrader. Yo, that will work for my bikes. Not my fat bike, but it'll work. Hmm. Man, what else do we have in here? Ooh. Oh. Hey guys, have you been walking around with a short valve? Well, your troubles are over. We've got valve extenders. One pair, 80 millimeters. Yes, sir. They are Presta valves. I don't know why you would need those, but there they are. What else do we have in this wonderful ticket? Shut up. Nobody wears sunglasses at night. Safety glasses, of course. Yeah. Let's cut this off. You never know. It must be something in here that is very dangerous. There we go. Good. Those are made by Remington. So these are probably for... Uh, these go with... From the five dollar, no, is it over here? No, is that it? No, doesn't matter. We're not done yet. Okay, I'm trying to bring out the interesting stuff here. Oh, look at this! I happen to have a truck that has a ball mount that could use that. That locks your ball mount on. Oh, I don't know where they went. What kind of, what kind of sunglasses should go on top of my? I don't, I don't know where they went. They're, they're gone. They're not there. No. Uh, yeah. No, that's um, right there. We're gonna lock stuff down right there. What else is in here? Oh, that rattling around. The little baggy of balls, huh? Huh? I assume that that is airsoft ammunition. Do you think that's what that is? I'm gonna guess. Where does the, where does that go? You're asking, that goes? No, they weren't. I think they're airsoft BBs, yeah. Um, that, look, that's where it goes, right there. If you're asking about that, am I close enough? Is it lit? Is it focused? Is it focused? Yeah, no, it goes in there, right? Keeps people stealing. It, it just prevents people from stealing your balls. Yeah. Or wait, no, it's a coupler locks. Yeah, no, it just, so people can't steal your balls. These feel like they're a little tinted. Are they a little tinted? They're, I think they're a little tinted, but they're not. So anybody is joining us, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it again. We are performance eyewear. These were Remington performance eyewear. We're opening some boxes from Princess Auto that were, uh, that were just, just junk. But you know what? There's some decent stuff in here, like these safety glasses. Where do my sunglasses go? Through them and they're back here. They're not there somewhere, are they? My valve extenders. I don't know where they went. Oh well, they're gone. We're still going. To my right. But everything is everything's backwards. Oh my gosh. Both boxes are really worth the money. 
Do I throw them that way? Do I throw them? Because it's backwards, right? I don't, I don't remember the one. It doesn't matter. So, we're, gonna, we're on a little bit of a theme now. We've got two electronic flares. And what kind of video would this be if we did not whip these batteries included? Excuse me? What? Hold on. Oh, six batteries included. And you know that these are the top quality batteries that you can possibly purchase. You can tell because they're nice and light. Oh. I'm going to have to use a knife again here. There we go. Got to get these in here. All right, all right. Yeah, shove that down in there, I guess. I didn't read the manual, I don't know what's gonna happen here. Oh, come on. Whoa, you better flash. Yeah, yep, it is now a disco party. Okay, I, well, well, look, there's one in the end. Is it on? No. There. Look at that. Oh, I should have been wearing my sunglasses. I'm blind now. Um, there. I think it's magnetic too, so can you guys see up? No, you can't see up there. I have nothing magnetic around here. It's magnetic anyway. Oh! Oh! Uh-huh. They just, they just go in there. They do. Well, we better get the next one going too. Well, I would say so. Yeah, no, they're AAA batteries. Now I can have a rave. All right. How long have we been going here, guys? I don't even know. Here we go. Let's get the... These are called Trek Safe. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right. I don't know. I drive a Toyota. I'm not going to need these. <laughs> yeah. Yep. I don't know where to put them now. They will sit over here. That's no, that's no good. That's no good. You know what? Let's try and stick this one here. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! Yeah. And this one over here. You guys see that one too? Enough. There we go. Alright. Road flares. And a nice uh, thing there. Doesn't matter. Toyotas don't break down, right? I can't click that. Okay. Ah, look at that. We're good. We got another matching set of fingers here. Yeah. The, the, uh, what are they called? They're self adhesive flat pads. Felt pads, not flat pads. Of course they're flat. This is good. Here, you know, I've been wondering where am I going to keep all of my bows? I, I have so many bows and I don't know where to put them. And this solves all of my bow problems. Well, that's great. Good stuff. How's it going, books? I hope you're doing well. We're opening up box two of the um, Princess Auto surplus box of crap that I got this morning. And we're down to the last two items, I'm afraid. I don't know which one to pull out first. Okay, here we go. This is probably the majority 
of the weight in this box. This is a standard coupler plate with a two inch ball and it's been seen on TV. I don't know what it does. Let's read the back. This coupler plate kit with its inverted ball, inverted balls, attaches to a standard trailer coupler. When in place, the inverted ball glides up the V ramp. I'm done. I am done. Guys, this is it. I'm afraid this box has come to an end. There's, there's only one thing left. Oh, I'm disappointed in this now. I'll have another drink of my iron brew. Ah, here we go. One, let's do the big reveal. This is one 30 watt slimline incandescent picture light. Huh? Yeah. Look at that. Ooh, adjustable shades, nickel finish, quality metal construction. Well, and then the rest of that is these little balls, and that's it. Well, somebody on my Christmas list is going to get lots of trailer towing accessories, I think. Uh, thanks for watching, joining in. I'll probably